so let's say uh, users invested in a fancy new tv maybe even an oled and you sit down to watch your first movie on your shiny new television that you paid a lot of money for and then you realize that while the picture quality the blacks the clarity everything and the 4k the hdr everything is amazing the sound exactly isn't tickling your fancy it is nowhere as good as the sound that you experience when you hop down to your local cinema or your imax theater yeah that's the situation i found myself in when i recently invested in a tv i found that the sound was uh, sound was sorely lacking and uh, that's why i wanted to upgrade from my 2.1 stereo system to the uh, to a dolby atmos package but what i quickly realized was that dolby atmos being a new fangled technology and dolby and it being a cutting edge technology doesn't come cheap the sound bars or the speakers that has this dolby atmos branding are extremely extremely uh, expensive but then there was a small ray of hope i found this company called zevronics an indian company and uh, that is selling a sound bar plus a subwoofer for as low as 13000 rupees in india so i actually didn't want to buy it as soon as i found it because i thought there must be a catch how is this company how is this company offering me dolby atmos technology at such a low price when the equivalent of uh, when it's equivalent from without any satellite speakers when it's equivalent from companies such as sony and jbl and philips and samsung are selling for at least thrice or four times the price well that is because uh, anyway first let's clear one thing up about dolby atmos to get actually to get the actual dolby atmos experience in your home there is one component that you absolutely need and that is ceiling mounted speakers you need at least two ceiling mounted speakers that fire their audio downwards towards you for that uh, immersive sound that home theater experience that fills the en- your entire living room or bedroom with sound so since that was uh, out of the bounds for me this is the second uh, this is the second best option or actually it is the third best option i would say because the second best option would have been uh, five discrete or separate speakers all around me at ear level but so that would have been the second best option but since i couldn't find a uh, good 5.1 dolby atmos system in my price range this probably this the zevronics jukebox 970 juke bar 9700 is my third best option and i went for it there are no surround speakers here so it has to make do with a sound bar and a subwoofer now the sound bar as you might have guessed is where most of the magic happens so it has got four front firing speakers so basically those uh, four front firing speakers they direct all your music towards you but then the real magic of dolby atmos is that uh, because it is a virtual surround sound because uh, no uh, sorry because it is object based surround sound so it uh, classifies uh, sounds into objects and uh, into discrete objects so there are two upwards firing speakers in this sound bar and they are they don't fire their audio directly upwards towards the ceiling they fire them at around a 45 degree angle towards the ceiling and then they get reflected of the ceiling and Uh, in an ideal scenario the audio from that ceiling comes down uh, and hits your ears reproducing the effect of sound uh, reverberating from uh, the ceiling 
for the immersive experience like let's uh, you have a uh, fighter plans or uh, whizzing above your head or uh, something crashing from above and those are the scenarios or even in gaming i would imagine that gaming would benefit from it a lot anyway uh, while i am unboxing uh, the jube 9700 in the video let me tell you about my actual experience with it which i don't have a footage about so what happened was uh, as soon as i set up the system uh, even before i set about this system i knew that what i was doing what i was buying was a compromise because there is no technology in the world that can actually reproduce the effect of surround speakers if you don't have physical surround speakers surrounding you does that make sense yeah so i with this setup just one soundbar and one subwoofer i had very low hopes about actual surround sound i knew that the center meets uh, front left right uh, sound separation and everything would be good and the reviews also told me that the subwoofer is extremely good in fact maybe a bit too good because the bass were on this uh, setup was so heavy that people were complaining on the amazon review page that they had to dial down uh, the subwoofer all the way down to minus five which is uh, which is the limit and even then the subwoofer was extremely bass heavy so much so that it was killing all the vocals and the small notes the small uh, notes uh. so i didn't have much hopes for the dolby atmos um, because dolby atmos is an expensive system it requires uh, lots of technologies and if other companies could faithfully replicate it at such a low cost then they would have done it and passed on the benefit to customers so here are all the cables it comes with and my experience was that uh, for the first 24 or uh, 48 odd hours the first couple of days i i did appreciate that the audio seemed to be filling up my entire living room uh, my entire bedroom where i use this but i didn't exactly I never, even when watching uh, movies on Atmos, like uh, one of the movies that I used to test it was all quiet on the western front. And even when I was watching the movie, I never felt like sound was coming to me, hitting me from the sides uh, like it would, it would in a theater. So uh, I actually returned this. Yes, I have returned this 9700 and uh, in its place, I bought the 9750 Dolby Atmos which comes with two surrounding speakers yes it has got two wireless uh, rear speakers and that is what I am using now not the product that you see in this video now that small upgrade of two speakers has actually uh, yes I did have to pay almost twice the price but it has actually enhanced the audio experience the home theater experience gaming experience for me a lot and i'm uh, i'm glad that i returned this product even though it worked uh, really well considering so yeah i'm glad that i paid uh, the little extra money for the surround speakers for the rear speakers because what is the point of going for a dolby atmos system if you can't exactly feel that experience at, uh, at your home uh, i will have a review for the 9750 up on my channel uh, soon if it if this particular video garners any interest at all so yeah that's about it thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye